believe most of the area will be dry for our 4th of July fireworks across the Susquehanna Valley, but there is a chance for a few isolated thunderstorms later this evening. Our weather is going to remain sticky, but where we should be for this time of the year, maybe muggier at times as by the time we head into Thursday into Friday, but it does look like we're going to have a more comfortable weekend, just slightly lower temperatures and also slightly lower humidity. Outside right now, it is a sticky but sunny picture over the capital city. We just have a few passing clouds and temperatures are in the lower 80s. Right now in the capital city, it's 82 degrees and the winds are out of the north northeast at six miles per hour. Independence Food Truck Festival and fireworks will be occurring in downtown Harrisburg a little bit later this afternoon and through the evening hours. All is quiet right now across the Susquehanna Valley on Super Doppler 8, but you can see a few isolated showers starting to bubble up just south of Altoona. There is a cold front draped right over. It looks like right over the turnpike and this cold front is going to meander eventually get slowly pushed down towards the Mason Dixon line as we head through the evening and overnight hours. So for today, partly sunny, just a slim ch chance of an isolated evening thunderstorm. It's going to be warm, sticky highs will be in the mid to upper 80s. Overnight tonight, just a slim chance of a passing shower and storm. Temperatures will fall to the upper 60s to near 70 degrees. Then for tomorrow, much of the same. Temperatures back into the mid 80s, a little less sticky, not much compared to today, but just subtly different compared to uh, this afternoon. So the best chances for those isolated showers and thunderstorms will be right around 9 o'clock to 10 o'clock and then should be a fizzling out just after midnight. So be prepared out there through the day. You know, download the weather app. We'll keep you posted. You can check out live radar. Temperatures will be in the upper 70s for the fireworks. Right now it's 82 in Lancaster, 86 if you're watching us in Chambersburg and 77 at the Sour in Sealands Grove. And check out the dew point difference across the region. Right now dew point is at 69 in Chambersburg, lower 60s towards Sealands Grove and back into the 50s in Scranton and Williamsport. So the front somewhere right over Harrisburg right now. Watch what happens here on the predictor. You can see as we head through the heat of the afternoon, just a isolated shower thunderstorm bubbling up. This will continue till after midnight. Front will get pushed to the south and it does look like the front just fizzles out as we head into Wednesday morning. Winds will start to change direction, turn back up out of the south and we could see an isolated shower and thunderstorm as we head through the day tomorrow. Best chance for the showers tomorrow will be west of the river. Then a weak area of low pressure starts to approach a region as we head into Thursday. Clouds will thicken up and I do expect higher rain chances for Thursday and, and it looks like it's going to be fairly wet through the day on Thursday stay with those passing showers. Some of these showers will be lingering into Friday as well. In terms of the humidity, sticky through the next couple of days, but as that storm system approaches us, uh, it's going to start to feel muggy as we head into Thursday into Friday. So isolated showers and thunderstorms are best through the day today, also on into the evening for the fireworks. Much of the same type of weather for tomorrow with just the chance, a little bit higher chance for those passing showers and thunderstorms to the west of the river. Widespread showers and thunderstorms a bit more likely as we head into Thursday and Friday, and then it looks like we just take the edge off just a touch heading into the weekend with highs in the lower 80s with just slightly less humidity. Well, that's good. Yeah. <laughs> All right. And I know you're looking forward I to am. this. Yep. An out of the world event will